All right, Cybus Bees, what's going on? Blunt Factory Cam, Blunt Plus Prime. I'm just going to show you guys a couple of stuff. I'm not, I'm actually, I'll probably just open one of these. I'll open one mini fridge only because uh, uh, I guess I'll just do it just because, you know, I want to try to get something out of these. All I really have, I mean, I have, I think I opened six of these since I bought the case of 40. So, I'm just going to open a random one today while I show you guys a couple things that I got. I got them um, some mail in. I'll show you what I got. All right. Get this stupid thing off here. All right. Right. So, I ended up ordering from, oh, no, man, I wish I would have wrote it down. Uh, actually, I think I know this. Uh, it's called the Atomic Nerd. And I got these pretty cool Joe Simcoe. Can you see that? I don't know. Is it signed Joe Simcoe? Now, I don't know what you, because it's, the lighting is not perfect where I'm at. But there's a line that goes across it, right? So I called them. I'm like, what's going on? I got this white print. I thought I ordered three silver prints, but I guess I ordered one white. And it... It's almost like, you know when I'm doing the cards and we get the roll mark? They said, nah, it's called, oh man, I wish I could look it up. There's a name for it. I'll let you know next time. But it's like when the roller rolls the cards off. So they wanted it to look not perfect, not pure white. And so it's kind of got like a dirty look to it. And it's got the roller mark going on it. It's, it's, it's cool. So I mistakenly bought this. I mean, I bought it on purpose, but mistakenly. I, I thought I was getting three silvers. I put a white in the card. I got it, and then I'm kind of happy I did because I was like, what's going on? Is this defective? They're like, no, that's how it's supposed to look. So I got this one. Okay. Uh, this one right here. This is a silver. The Joe Simcoe sign. I think they're limited to 300. And then I got this one right here. You guys can see it. It's really glary with the silver. Right. So I got those three. Right. I got those three in. And then... Uh, oh, no. This is crazy. I want to show you this, but I don't know. I'll have to get into the... I don't know where I put them. I hope it's this one. I think it's this one. No. Those are the celebrity chefs. I haven't opened any of them. The only one I opened was the one that came in a four-piece loaded sketch. Oh, maybe it's over here. That's not it either. That's my old school magnet sets. Whatever year those are, 2000 or something. Who even knows what is the year on these things? 212. I think I have all the magnets too. It's rare. Wait, when I started digging up after the food fight, I started digging up all my old um, garbage pail stuff, and I had a bunch of stuff I didn't know that I even still had. This is it. So I got these. This is also a tonic nerd. Check these out. These are so cool. Look at these. Right? How cool is that? So these are um, garbage pails crossover with the um with the uh Mars attacks so I think this is alien Ian and then this is outer space chase if I'm not mistaken I've been looking at them over and over I'll show you this now so they come with a back so that's like this so it'll go like this you see you could take the uh two two nice Sturdy um, pin, very sturdy pin with two. All right, so you put that through the back. This is a special preview card. It says, This is a special preview card of the upcoming GPK Attack six card wax collection pack available only from Sidekick Lab. So they did a, did the the people at Sidekick Lab did a Kickstarter 
and it has GPK. It's Mars Attacks, but it has GPK um, packs in it also. If you bought the Kickstarter, you're going to get some of them. Um, I'm pretty sure the Kickstarter, I know, is over. I know that's over. This is the card that came with it. I know that uh, Kickstarter is over, but I think you can still buy like the fan club pack if you go on there, and then you can add on. They have add-ons, so you can get like so. There's the outer space chase, so you can get um, the garbage pill pack. Still, I think they're about ten, ten dollars a piece or something. There's only six cards. Okay, so these I thought were awesome. I liked them a lot. So both of those. The, um, these cards and the, um, pins and the, uh, pretty cool Jim, so, uh, I'm sorry, Joe Simcoe, uh, um, auto photos. They all came from Atomic Nerd. You can check that out. Those are pretty cool. I know also this week, Get a Grip Skateboards, um, they're going to be dropping the, um, the skateboards this week. One per household. That's it. One per household. So, one per household. And, uh... Oh, we didn't get a loaded sketch. No good. Let's see what we get in here. Let's see what happens here. Um... Oh! 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 I did get other mail. I got some um, uh, Marino design mail that came in. I showed you guys this one last time, the Victor Marino. I showed you this one, Victor Marino. This is the one that just came in yesterday with all this stuff. That's my Mumra. Adam do Mumra from the Thundercats. That's a Victor Marino. I'm really excited to see when he's going to drop this uh, Kickstarter and what kind of um, artwork he's going to have with it, what it's going to be. Uh, I want to see uh, what kind of rewards he's going to have, how much the tears are going to be. It's going to be interesting. Because I mean, he bangs these things out, um, which is great artwork, right? He does these pretty much... I mean, the first time I ever got one, he was banging them out for twenty bucks, uh, twenty five dollars a piece. He's like, "I'll do a special today, twenty five dollars." Uh, that was during the Star Wars one. That was this one, and so I paid him for this, but I didn't give him twenty five. I gave him forty. I gave him a tip. I I I gave him more money than I. I never I've never paid him what he's asked. I've always given him more because I just feel like sometimes you pay people, you give people a little more. You know, what they're worth, work's worth, you know. But, uh, yeah, I gave him, um, the first time I think it was about $40. For, for what he wanted was for 25 uh, I'm not rich, so I just did it to, you know, to prove the fact that I love his art. I pay before he even touches the pen to my thing. I tell him I want one. Before he even starts writing on my cards, I send the payment. I don't ever want to have to deal with any kind of, um, you know, I, I, I think if you're asking the artist to do the work, you let them just do the work. Let them do the work and then uh, leave it and then you should be so happy with what you get. This is so cool. Like, I love the background. See, this background is just red. Okay, cool. But like this one, it's got like the background. It's so sick, right? How he does that, right? And same with the 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 Cobra Commander, the way he made that one look. Like, see that with the dots, and then like it's like an explosion like behind him. And stuff. He's just really talented. See the explosion at the bottom. It's phenomenal, phenomenal. So anyway, those are my Marino sketches for the for the day. I got the Mumra and I got the um, Violator from Spawn. I'm a big, big, big Spawn figure fan. I got way more Spawn than I do Garbage Pails. I'll tell you that right now. 
All right, let's open these packs, see what happens, see if anything happens. See what we get. I've heard of people getting good stuff. I only got one thing. I got a full piece sketch out of these things. I haven't really seen much else since then. I don't even need the base. I have too many base. I have a library of base cards. I just every time I get a chance, I sit down and I build more. And then I just put the whole base set in here. I put 200 cards in there with usually a scratched off Adam Appetite inside. And then hopefully one day I can say, hey, I can, I'll can i sell you a base set of 200 inside a mini fridge. And I'll do it with uh, an Adam Appetite in there. It would be cool to see. If I could get some dollars back on these cards that I spent so much on. Yeah, so I'm excited about the skateboards. I really want to get one. I, I, um, I was telling my wife I'd like to get one. I'd say, oh, it'd be awesome to get one for each of the kids. You know what? You can't. One per household is only 300 And there's no way you're going to get one. There's so many scalpers and other people waiting. They're going to be licking their chops. This is worse than the uh, Animal Crossing um, cards I was trying to get for my son. We're online. My wife's on one computer. I'm on one computer. We're trying to and get put in the card at Target. Uh, Target exclusive. Put in the card over and over. Try to cash out. Couldn't happen. Site crashes. We never get the damn card. No, whatever. You know, they're online selling it for a million dollars. I go on Pinterest, there's a girl making the cards. Oh, there you go. <clears throat> Give her 20 bucks for the out-of-print cards that you can't get now. You know, limited time exclusives. That were $5, $5.99 at the store. That I said, watch when I get home, they're going to be, they're going to be, uh, you know, 60 bucks. Right when I got home, that's exactly how much they were. I couldn't believe it. Because I ain't doing that. I ain't going to give you $60 for a pack of cards that was five ninety nine. Can't do it. All right, people. I don't think there's anything in here. Well, let's see what we got. Again, I just really wanted to have something. I figured I'd open it. I'm hoping maybe we'll get something out of here. I just talked to a couple people. One guy, he, he only opened two of these. He's got, he got two sketch. My friend came over the other day. He opened one collected tin of food fight. And he opened one of these. He had two sketch. I'm like, man, you guys. You guys got way better odds than me. I might have got some good hits, but I had to pay for them, that's for sure. It definitely cost some money. All right, so you guys can see what we got. And green border. We should go through the green borders. I'm going to go through those. Maybe I'll go through them today, see if I got the full set, and the, and also check the uh, the black border, too. I didn't show, I didn't show you guys the other thing I got in the mail, though. That was, <clears throat> that was really, really, really big. I think you all know what it is, though, anyway. Anybody who's sticking around with me, anybody who's been on this, <clears throat> excuse me, roller coaster ride with me, I think they know what it is. Nice. You got a bunch of those to redeem. <laughs> and these tins are horrible. It's just, there's like no cards. It's like just so little cards. I feel like I'm done. I just opened that. It was 20 bucks and I already opened it. There's nothing in it. Thanks a lot. I didn't get anything good. Oh, there's my yellow. You got a yellow every time. Trashy tray. My most disgusting card that I hate the most. The Disgusting. Got a bunch of A and B's though in that one. Look at that. 
I love that one. Self serve. Like self serve Stevie, baby. All right, we got a bunch of nothing prospectus. A bunch of nothing. All right, that's cool. I'm pretty much, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm about to retire the, um, <laughs> I'm, I'm, oh man, I'm about to retire the food fight breaking. <clears throat> I got a couple more cans. Maybe I'll do like a four mini fridge one and maybe then I'll just stop. I was going to save half and rip half. Then I was like, wouldn't it be awesome to just open all 40? Then I'm like, no, because they could potentially be worth money sometime. So my initial thing was when I got the case was I was going to keep 40 of them and I was going to sell 40 of them and just get $20 a tin back. <clears throat> I haven't sold one. I haven't sold one. So I'm thinking maybe just break the 20 and save 20. I don't know. I really don't know. I'm trying to just open one and have a four-piece sketch fall out like it did before. And nobody's seen that one. It's coming. I'm going to show you what I got, everybody. It's probably... It'll probably be a video where I show, like, all my my sketches at one time. And then I'll show everybody my four-piece loaded one that... The first sketch I got that I didn't do videos. This is before I did any videos. I didn't videotape any of my breaks until I got this sketch. Because it was my first sketch I got. And after I hit that sketch, it was locked down. That's it. Totally locked down and, and on target. And on um, just couldn't stop. Like addicted. Straight. Addicted to cracking cards again, so it's hard. I also have um really cool Trevor Lawrence um tops exclusives coming in. I'm gonna open them. I won't put those in my garbage pail playlist, but I am gonna open. I'll just put that in my I collect shit um playlist, and then you guys can just check that one out. But that's really I'm excited to see what I got in there because I was I could have bought ten. They, I could have bought 10. I think they limited you up to 10 or something, but I got four. And uh, when I looked online, I know they were 75 in tax, whatever, when you bought them, but I've seen them um, when they first were, before they were coming out. And the pre orders, people had them for like 125. Now I see them selling for 250 to, um, I'm sorry, excuse me, whoops, 150 to 200. So that's cool. So I'd like to see what I do with those. Maybe run a, run a um, raffle on those, you know what I mean? On uh, maybe like two of them. I'd like to open one, save one, and then get rid of the other two. But it'd be cool to do a raffle for 10 bucks a piece, right? And just do uh, 20 slots, you know? Make 200 bucks, you know? And uh, we'll see if the guy pans out. Not everybody pans out, you know? They don't live up to the hype. All of the NFL is different than what the... College was, and then they have way harder time. Or they get injured, or whatever. It can happen. Anything can happen. You're never given tomorrow. You're blessed to be here today, and that's what you need to be focused on. Because uh, nobody's promised tomorrow, you know? So, yeah, hopefully the guy pans out. I'm hoping he does. I'm hoping he pans out because I got some of his stuff, and I'm hoping that it does, so. Nice, a little more base. I'll bring this down. Bring it down to the depths in the dungeon with the rest of them. Um, all right, so we didn't get nothing. We got one Adam Appetite. I'm going to redeem all them later. Uh, I was going to do a 30, 50 anniversary after the, uh, the horrible cards that I got. But instead, today, I'm going to try to take care of that trash tin that was garbage. I took a bunch of photos with my phone and... I, it, it does no justice. You really can't see how gross the cards have been and destroyed. But um, I am going to just kind of submit it to them. I'll send them an email or something and say, I bought this whole thing. 
I don't know if you want me to return all the cards. I know, you know, I don't want to get rid of the can because it's a spray paint can. I'm going to let them know that too, you know. I'll be like, I'll send you back all the cards, but I'm not going to send back the can. It's going to be more cost and more shipping for me. And it's also the collector can. I'd like to keep that at least, you know. But again, with the uh, disease, they might just tell you, you know, oh, we see it and we, we you know. If they watch the video, you could definitely see because in the video you can see it way worse. But anyway, I'm trying to get find my receipt um, from from Dave and Adams. I bought a bunch of them from them. That's where I got them all. So I got to get the receipt. I'd like to show the receipt too and say, hey, this is the receipt. This is what I paid. This is what this is what I got. The whole thing was, you know, x that out. And maybe they just sent me a new one. Maybe they sent me a hit. Maybe they sent me a coupon. Who knows? But anything would be better than a whole hobby case, a whole hobby trash can of dented cards. <clears throat> what I did was I took them all and I put them in the box back there. I just put them in the box with all the packs and that's it. So every card that I got is in there. Even the uh, hits. Even the hits. So if I have to send them back, I will. You know, you can keep my auto. Maybe just send me a new, new, new trash can. All right, everyone, that's me mumbling and bumbling for uh, my morning episode. Birds are out. Day's about to start. I got to get rocking and rolling. Good dad gang uh, going down. And then um, I'll get back to you guys. I got some more stuff going on. I got a really interesting video to come. And uh, I don't want to show all my sketches and stuff. I had a f friend, hey, show me all your, your, your collection and stuff and like I'm like my collection is pretty much on video everything you guys seen me pull is here <clears throat> except for the 4 piece sketch but when it's done when I'm done pulling movies, when I'm done because I'm not doing the hobby no more this is what I was going to say the collected tins we just did a case of them right we got 7 autographs and 2 sketch out of it I'm like maybe I should buy another case there's no way I can get more autographs is there can I get another case with all autographs? Wouldn't it be better if I opened one and I got a case with all <laughs> sketch cards? I just don't know, man. I just, I don't know. I don't think I can do it. I don't think I'm going to do it. But then again, I keep, it's easy just to push the button. So, <clears throat> I don't know. I wasn't too thrilled with the seven autos out of the case, you know. The two sketch cards were beautiful, though. So, uh, you might just see me in vacation in September or uh, Chrome. I do have Chrome that I'm going to open to. So, all right. Um, God bless all you guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, prospectors and junkies alike. We shall dig into some more um, product. I just don't really know. I just wanted to do a little update with the Marino sketches and those uh, Atomic Nerds. I don't know how um, available they're going to be. Like I said, those the photos were only uh, limited to 300. And then those um, alien pins. Oh, shoot. I should have. I should have. Actually, no, I don't think I can. I don't know. Let me see if I can. Oh, man, it's like this, right? Oh, man. I have the wrong can again. Let me see if I can end this like this. Shoot. All right, hold on. This is what we'll do. I want to show you guys. All right. So, we'll see if this works. And this is how one this video, yeah. Uh-oh. It's time. Time to start the day. All right, check it out, everyone. Here we go. All right, so... We'll catch up next time. And I appreciate you all watching. And God bless you. Until next time.